Hey, this is Thomas here, and here's another scholarship that is due in the month of December. All right, if you don't want to miss out on any of my other scholarship videos or other content on my channel, then don't forget to like and subscribe. But let's go ahead and jump straight into this scholarship today. Here we have the Hagen Scholarship, and it is a $48,000 scholarship. Now, I will say the $48,000 is it's a renewable scholarship. So the $48,000 is total over four years, not each year, but $48,000 total that you can win with this scholarship. Now, it is due December 1st. Are you eligible for the scholarship? You must be a U.S. citizen. You must attend a public high school located in a city, town, or rural area having fewer than 25,000 residents and listed on the HSF website. So you can check that out. Uh, you must have a minimum of 3.5 GPA, enrolled at an eligible four-year college or university, and you have to graduate in four years. In addition to that, you must also work 240 hours in the 12 months prior to each fall semester in college. So you have to be working while you're attending college to be eligible. Uh, you must have a household income below $85,000. So this is a needs-based scholarship. You must provide the FAFSA SAR, which is a student aid report showing the EFC, which is your estimated family contribution. And you must apply for federal and state grants if they are eligible. And then you also must not have a felony conviction against you. So that's a ton. Let's go back to this one. Pause the video if you need to or this one as well. Pause the video if you need to, to make sure that you're eligible for this one. All right, what do you have to do? You also have to have a personal essay, write a personal essay, and have a four-year plan. They detail the specifics of that on the website. So here's how you're going to apply. You're going to download my monthly scholarship PDF for December, and then you're going to scroll down until you get to this scholarship, click the link, go directly to the web page, and all the information and all the steps you need in order to get the process started to apply are right there. Now, if you're still in high school, I do have a course published on ways to pay for college. And this is great if you're still in high school or maybe if you're a parent of somebody who's in high school preparing for college, then this is a great resource for figuring out ways to pay for college more than just scholarships, more than just grants and a lot of things that maybe you haven't thought about yet. So definitely check that course out if you're interested in other ways to pay for college. Or you can check out this playlist for more scholarship information or this video that YouTube thinks you need to watch next. Either way, we will see you in the next one.